So this one is Beware the Shadow Catcher. You don't want him to catch your shadow, I guess. Start a new game, yes. In normal mode, the shadows will order as normal. In easy mode, the shadows will tell you exactly what they want. Let's normal it up. Final notice. It's like a pass due. Overdue. What up, Sam? Okay, so we're $2,000 in debt. Yikes. We've had zero customers over the last three days. The rent is due by the end of the week. This isn't good, Mod. <laughs> Mod. So what are we gonna do? Mod! Oh dang! Mod's big! I brewed some coffee for us, dear. Do you want some? No, I don't want any coffee. I want to figure out a way to keep us from losing the diner. Are you even listening to me? Of course I'm listening. I just don't understand how this happened, dear. So many folks used to come here to eat, we couldn't even fit them all in the building. We've had folks outside eating, folks in the parking lot, just everywhere. Do you remember that time the mayor stopped by? Remember what he said? He said you didn't let him eat in peace. After that, he said it was the best meal he'd ever had. Yes, he did, but the food isn't the problem here, Mod. First of all, the place hasn't been properly cleaned in years. I do my own cleaning. I'm not going to pay someone for something I can do myself. Yeah, well, second of all, people are afraid to walk in here because you keep the lights too dim. Dimming the lights saves money on the electricity bill. You cheap, cheap. Cheap, cheap. That's just good business, dear. Oh, it is? Fine, then. Let's talk about good business. Was it good business when you scared our last customer away because they saw you washing your clothes in the sink? <laughs> Why, this place has been in my family for generations. Great granddaddy Icarus built this diner, then it went to granddaddy, then it went to my mother, now it's mine. And if I want to do my laundry in the sink, then I'll do my laundry in the sink. I swear, talking to you is like talking to a brick wall sometimes. Um, excuse me? Yo, what up, shadow people? Mr. Shadow, terribly sorry to interrupt my wife. Hello there, daughter. Hi. And I were just in the neighborhood when we spotted this lovely little diner. May we sit, please sit down and eat? Of course, make yourself at home and I'll bring you folks a menu. Mod, wait a minute, there's obviously something wrong here. They don't have faces. Hush, Samantha, we serve everybody here so long as they're decent people. Even faceless shadow folk. Thank you, ma'am. Please note I have a peanut allergy. Before we dine, there is something I should mention. It's a peanut allergy, I knew it. As you can probably tell, we're not from around here. We come from a desolate land without light. It's awful back home. We like it better here. This is exactly right. But there is a being that exists between our lands. He does not take kindly to those who cross over, and we have drawn his hateful gaze many times on our journeys. That's fine, dear. We can cook something for him, too. I don't think you understand, ma'am. Every time we venture out, we feel his watchful gaze somewhere behind us. He has not been able to catch us yet, but we fear that it will happen. What will happen if he does? Among ourselves, we have a saying that we must not forget. Beware the shadow catcher. He will no doubt turn his attention towards you if you choose to let us stay. 
Is that so? Well then, this shadow catcher considers himself banned from Maud's diner. We don't cater to troublemakers here. Maud, this sounds dangerous. Nonsense, these kind folks just want to have a nice night out. They're welcome to stay as long as they want. Samantha, would you please find out what our guests want to eat? I'll be over in the kitchen. Just let me know if I need to start cooking, dear. Fine. But I don't like this at all. Not one bit. Thank you very much, miss. Please be sure to keep watch for him. He will no doubt come to the door in search of us. When he does, you must stay in somewhere that is not visible from the doorway. If he thinks that no one is here, he will most likely decide to leave. Oh, I'm ordering. It is our tradition to never speak the name of what we wish to eat. It is bad luck to do so. Hopefully service will not be too much of a hassle for you. Now then, would you please bring me a dish that contains pork? I don't think I want any sandwiches. And I don't want a dish that is mostly red in color. Thank you. I'm not supposed to tell you what I want to eat. Mom and Papa have silly traditions. I don't get it. So, I want something with eggs in it, please. And I don't want anything with pork in it. Nothing that's mostly red. You guys don't like red. Our family has rather strange traditions when ordering food. I hope you don't mind too much. With that said, I'd like some type of dish that contains pasta. As an ingredient. You need, you need vegetables, dude. I also don't want any sandwiches. What the hell's wrong with you? Why wouldn't you want a sandwich? They're the best food in the world. Alright. Don't overwork yourself, dude. Take a break if you need to. I'm fine, Mod. You worry too much sometimes. You just need to finish these orders and then we can both go home. Uh, how do I figure out these orders? All right, how do I give you orders, though? Do I go outside? Nobody's there. We're clear. We're in the clear. But how do I, do I go around? Whoa, this lady's fast! Okay. Bacon and eggs. Crack two eggs on the grill. Cubed ham. Crack two eggs on the grill. Give me eggs. Give me eggs. Give me eggs. I have an egg. <gasps> What's going on? What is he doing? Why is he doing this? I mean, Maude was never seen again. A heartbroken Samantha was devastated after the loss. She was consumed by guilt, blaming herself for not preventing Maude from allowing the shadow sin. If she had only stepped in and said no, then the shadow catcher would never arrive in the first place. She tried to manage the diner without Maude's help, but was sadly unsuccessful. After losing both her friend and the diner, Samantha was forced to leave town in search of work. She never looked back. I mean, there wasn't even like a warning that there was a shadow there. The shadow catcher was there. He just, like, bust open the door. <laughs> Grab Mod. Beware the shadow catcher. <sighs> yeah, right, please. I didn't read all that stuff just to do it again. Next game.